What is something that you wish you still had? Something mm. that may be from your childhood that you might have lost or, you know, a particular item that you had collected that's now gone. What, what's the answer to yeah, this one, so, Travis? Yeah, uh, so I have a really good answer for this. Um, I'm, so I'm a musician and there's sort of a rule that I've learned as I've gotten older, which is never sell any of your gear. And so over my uh, 25 years of being a musician, I've traded and sold gear and most of it I regret. So like you think you're going to upgrade to the next thing, but really you're losing a piece of your, your musical history. So probably, I would probably say like just my first guitar, just like I know so many people that have their first guitar. And even though mine wasn't mm. that cool, I would love to be able to like give it to my kids and say, this was my first guitar and make it their first guitar. But, you know, sometimes you just gotta, you gotta try to parlay your next big uh, instrument. So definitely musical gear. Yeah, for sure. That's awesome. Good answer. Good answer, by the way. I need All to right. know your answer to these questions though. What, what, what have you, oh, uh, what have you? I love that you're throwing it back to me every time. That's, that's awesome. I think for me, it would be, I had, uh, this is the dumbest thing, but I had this uh, frog. It was a teddy bear type of thing. And I used to lay on the floor with it and watch the cartoons on a Saturday morning. And I remember having that frog right up until I was probably from the age of about three, right through to maybe 10 or something. And and I called him Froggy, you know, and, and it was just, yeah. And now it would barely fit on my chest. But back when I was little, it was probably felt like the size of the room, you know, but yeah. yeah, and it was all kind of squished and mangled, and I'm sure it got dirty and stained. I think it got washed a few <laughs> times, but Froggy was Froggy yeah. was mine, and he was cool. And if I still had that, that would be that would be nice. Yeah. So when you turned ten, you just got too cool for it. You're like, I don't need this frog anymore. I think it just vanished one day. I think it was a case of a clean up. You know, maybe a, a little bit of a, mm. a house house arrest maybe type of thing where intervention of, <laughs> of your childhood came through and and a lot of the toys got yeah. got thrown out or upgraded or whatever so yeah froggy's gone oh oh poor yeah. froggy 